Emulsion is light sensitive. You put it on the screen to make your screen like a piece of photographic film. After you pour the emulsion into the trough, make sure you put the lid back on the container so that the material in the container remains free from light. Take the trough and hold your screen at about a 45 degree angle. You want to position the trough so that the emulsion evenly falls down onto the screen. Once you have an even contact of emulsion with the screen, you want to slowly pull the emulsion across the top of the screen. At this point, tilt the trough back, let the emulsion fall, and then you can either turn your screen and go in the other direction or coat it again. Next you want to coat the inside of your screen with the same process. When coating your screen, you want to make sure you start with a clean screen and you also want to make sure it's dry. You want to do this process quickly because as I said earlier, it's a light sensitive material. You also want to make sure that as you are lifting the trough up your screen, you're doing it in a manner that's not going to create air bubbles or thick goops and streaks. After you have applied the emulsion to the screen, take your screen into the paper storage closet. There's a fan, and you'll turn on the fan. It's on a timer that runs for an hour. You'll place your screen in the storage unit. Once your screen's in the storage unit, make sure that you put your name on a piece of tape and put your name onto your screen so that you can tell your screen from other people's screens. After you have your screen in the storage cabinet, make sure that you turn off the light because your screen is light sensitive. Make sure you have the fan going and shut the door. After you've put your screen in the storage closet, Make sure that you put the rest of the emulsion back into the emulsion container and wash off the trough and the spatula in the sink. The trough and the spatula can be cleaned using water, a scrub brush, and solvent that can be found within the sink. Once you have washed them off, make sure that you put them back where they belong.